Hello everyone, how to solve this math Olympiad question? 81 power sine square x plus 81 power cos square x is equal to 30. We'll find out what is the value of x in this equation. So first of all I can say here is 81 power is sine square x plus 81. We know that cos square x is equal to 1 minus sine square x. So I can say it will be 1 minus sine square x is equal to 30 then let sine square x is equal to u this time i can say here is 81 power is u plus 81 power is 1 minus u is equal to 30 then i can say here is 81 power u plus we know that the exponential rows a to the power n minus m is equal to a to the power n over a to the power m according to these rules i can say here is 81 power 1 minus u it will be 81 power 1 over 81 power u is equal to 30. then I can say here is least common value is 81 power u so this times this it will be 81 power u bracket power is 2 plus this divide this it will be 1 so 1 times 81 it will be 81 is equal to 30 then I can say here is 81 power is u bracket power is 2 plus 81 is equal to 30 times 81 power u I just multiply both sides 81 power u then let again 81 power u is equal to a this time I can say here is a square plus 81 is equal to 30 a but this equation becomes a square minus 30 a plus 81 is equal to 0 then if i factorization i mean middle factor i can say 81 it will be 27 times 3 and here is minus so it will be minus this is minus so i can say here is a square minus 27 a minus 3 a plus 81 is equal to 0 look 27 times 3 it will be 81 and minus 27a minus 3a it will be minus 30a then I can say here is a is common so a square divide a it will be a minus 27a divide a it will be 27 minus here is 3 is common so this a divide this it will be a plus minus it will be minus and 81 divide 3 it will be 27 is equal to 0 then I can say again here is a minus 27 is common so this a divide this it will be a and this a divide this it will be minus 3 is equal to 0 then we'll find out here is two case our first case is a minus 27 is equal to 0 and others case a minus 3 is equal to 0 but I can say here is a is equal to 27 I just move on minus 27 in right side we'll find out positive 27 but remember that a is 81 power u so I can say here is 81 power u is equal to 27 then it will be 81 like as 3 power 4 and this u is equal to 27 it will be 3 power 3 then we know that here is basis same according to exponential rules I can say this exponent are equal so I can say here is 4 u is equal to 3 and I can say easily here is u is equal to 3 over 4 And others case we'll find out here is a minus 3 is equal to 0 so I can say a is equal to 3 
and you know that is 81 power u so according to this case i can say here is 81 power u is equal to 3 and 81 like is 4 power 3 and this u is equal to 3 sorry 3 power 4 is equal to 3 power 1 then i can say here is 4 u is equal to 1 and here is u is equal to 1 over 4 then remember that u is sine square x here is u is sine square x so i can say here is sine square x is equal to 3 over 4 and here is sine square x is equal to 1 over 4 then it will be if i use both side square root so i can say sine x is equal to plus minus square root 3 over 2 and here is sine x is equal to plus minus 1 over 2 now <coughs> we'll find out the value of x so i can say this is y this is x and this is a circle and this is 1 0 and this is minus 1 0 and this is 0 1 and this is 0 minus 1 now we know that sine x is opposite by hypotenuse so i can say here is opposite is 3 over 2 and hypotenuse is 1 so i can say easily here is this is opposite it is square root 3 over 2 according to plus value and here is 1 and this value is 60 degree and it is in radian i can say it will be 5 over 3 and again i can say here is in this case i can say this angle is uh, 180 degree minus 60 it will be 120 degree so in this case i can say this angle is radian 2 5 by 3 and again i can say in this case when value is negative so i can say 180 degree plus 60 it will be 240 degree and it is in radian 3 4 5 by 3 and again negative case i can say in this case so here is this angle is uh total 300 because of that 360 minus 60 it will be 300 in radian 5 5 by 3 so i can say easily in this case when sine x is equal to positive square root 3 over 2 and when sine x is equal to negative square root 3 over 2 in this case x is equal to 5 over 3 plus 2 and pi here is n is constant and i can say again x is equal to 2 5 over 3 and here is 2 and phi. here is n is constant and in this case i can say here is x is equal to 4 5 over 3 4 5 over 3 plus 2 and phi and n is n is constant and again here is x is equal to 5 5 over 3 plus 2 and phi and others case where find out here is sine x is equal to plus minus half so again i can say here is this is a circle and this is 1 0 and this is minus 1 0 and this is 0 1 and this is 0 minus 1 so in this case i can say here is this angle so this angle is 30 degree because of that this is is half and this is one so i can see easily this is 30 degree and 30 degree it will be 5 by 6 180 divide 6 it will be 30 degree 
and in this case I can say easily this angle is 180 degree minus 30 it will be 150 degree so it will be 5 5 over 6 and other case here is so I can say it will be 180 degree plus 30 it will be 210 uh, in radian 5 5 7 5 by 6 and here is I can say 1 sorry 3 60 degree minus 30 it will be 3 3 0 degree and it is 11 5 by 6 so I can say here is when sine x is equal to positive half and when sine x is equal to negative half in this case I can say x is equal to pi over 6 plus 2 and pi here is n is constant and here is x is equal to 5 phi over 6 so 5 phi over 6 plus 2 and phi and in this case when negative I can say here is x is equal to 7 phi over 6 plus 2 and phi and here is x is equal to 11 pi over 6 plus 2 and phi so this is our final answer thank you this is this is this is this is thanks for watching goodbye